Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and of course one of the things that you might want to do in Windows 10 we talked about it in the past but I'm going to update the video is choose the correct um, graphics adapter depending on if you're a gamer or not there are apps and there are games that you might want to have and make sure that it uses the iPerformance adapter. One of the problems is that even though the automatic process of selection usually works well, it's not always 100%. Also, one of the really sad things that happened is that they removed the contextual menu option of this eventually. Uh, it used to be in the past that you can right-click on an app, executable, and choose um, Run with iPerformance Performance Adapter. Now, you can't. You have to really go through the uh, option. So what you could do is simply go to your start menu, then go into the settings app. In the system app you will have of course the options for the display. In here if you go down you'll see graphics settings. In the graphics settings you will see which apps you want to use as a app for uh, either a Microsoft Store app or a standard uh, game or app that you, a desktop app as we call them, for running on high performance. So this is really for people that have two graphics adapters on their computer. Now some have the option and take the option of just removing the basic one and keep only the high performance. On a desktop PC that could go but on a laptop, you don't necessarily want to do that because if you use it on battery regularly, the battery life will be really, really uh, diminished if you use only the high performance. So if you want to change the graphics adapter setting for an app or a game, what you do is you simply choose which app. If it's a Microsoft Store app, it's pretty easy because you just select an app and then you go into the app that you want and in that app then you can actually say add and then you have the options i performance now in my case i have only one graphics adapter so it's always the same thing but if you have two you'll see that you have your basic uh, graphics adapter and you have the high performance which will be a different one like on my gaming machine that i have it's an nvidia so when that happens you'll want to um do that and choose the, perf the, the, the correct one that you want. Uh, if it's a desktop app, that's where it's a little more complicated because desktop apps, you need to browse and you need to know where the app is. So you might need to go to your local disk and then go to the program files, depending on the game, and choose the correct game or app that you want it to run uh, with, the, uh, with the app. So depending on what it is, then choose the application itself, add it, and once you add it, you, once again, you'll have the options to do high performance or not. So this is a little more complicated, and I wish it would be simpler for the desktop apps, but at least you have an option. You just need to know where the executable of whatever app you have exists within that computer. So this will actually let you choose which app. It's not 100%. I've had a couple of cases where it just didn't work even when choosing manually. But for the most part, it will work in general. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.